In a shocking critique, political analyst Mark Halperin has labeled Vice President Kamala Harris' first interview as the Democratic nominee a disaster for journalism. Conducted by CNN's Dana Bash, the interview drew sharp criticism for being too soft and failing to ask the tough questions voters care about. Halperin praised Harris for her performance, noting her confidence and control tone, but he didn't shy away from calling the interview a missed opportunity. According to him, the lack of challenging questions allowed Harris to breeze through without addressing critical issues. Vice President Kamala Harris is hitting the road in a bold move to champion reproductive rights across America. That fighting for reproductive freedom bus tour kicks off in none other than Palm Beach, Florida, former President Trump's own hometown. With over 50 stops planned in both red and blue states, this tour is more than just a campaign event, it's a direct challenge to Trump's stance on abortion and the Supreme Court's overturning of Roe v. Wade. Harris is joined by prominent figures like Second Gentleman Douglas Emhoff and Senator Amy Klobuchar, who will speak to voters about the stark contrast between Harris's vision and Trump's policies. From advocating for the restoration of Roe v. Wade protections to holding Trump accountable for his actions, this tour is set to redefine the conversation around reproductive rights in the lead-up to the next election. The legal battle surrounding the tragic death of Friends star Matthew Perry continues as Dr. Mark Chavez, one of the physicians involved, appeared in a Los Angeles court. Charged with conspiring to distribute ketamine, Chavez has entered into a plea agreement with federal prosecutors. This follows the revelation that Perry, who passed away in October 2023 due to the acute effects of ketamine, was provided the drug through a fraudulent prescription. Chavez, who has now surrendered his medical license, is just one of five people charged in this heartbreaking case. The drama continues as other key figures in the case face their day in court. Angelina Jolie, one of Hollywood's most iconic actresses, may be on the brink of a major career revival. After years of mixed reviews and taking time off for her family, Jolie returns to the big screen in E. Maria, a biopic about the legendary opera singer Maria Callas. Directed by Pablo Lorraine, this film dives deep into the life of Callas, from her troubled romance with Aristotle Onassis to the pressures that nearly destroyed her career. Jolie's portrayal is already drawing Oscar buzz, with many critics hailing it as her best work since Girl, Interrupted. The film's intense emotional scenes and Jolie's powerful performance make a Maria a must-watch, especially for those who love musical biopics. This could be the role that finally brings Jolie back to the Oscar stage, don't miss out on what could be a defining moment in her illustrious career. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates hit the bell icon to stay notified of our latest videos.